Right, looks like we're cutting this in half. Oh yeah. Can we get a whole roof done in five hours? Sure, not very poor concrete in. <laughs> got like got like a small boating lake in there, haven't we? Right, so it's been bucketed, uh, bucketing it down overnight. So, but after ten o'clock, it's about nine o'clock now, maybe. Um, it's going to stop raining, so we've got everything now to make the roof watertight. So, what we need to do is get everything done, and as soon as the rain stops, we can put all the balls down, and we can put the roof down. Make it sound quite easy. piece is called but this piece wasn't quite long enough so a butt block I could call it one of them it's a different colour I've noticed a little mistake don't make mistakes. <laughs> what? My umbrella's a bit trapped. Yeah, it's okay. Got a little grinder. Now, yeah, it was sort of we wanted somewhere to try and keep the electrics dry a bit. But the work has to carry on, doesn't it? So I'm sure we'll get it out. Right, time to fit the gutters. It's going to be a lot easier to fit the gutters now because of the, um, we've got access over the back and it says leaning off and we're still waiting for the weather to change, so. And they can collect all this rainwater. They can collect the rainwater, yeah. Gemma wants to collect the rainwater. So we can water, we haven't even got any flowers, Jim. We can water the grass. See we? bath water. See the bath. I can't have, have an outside shower. Ooh. What's it going like there? Anyway, right, gutter time. So we've got the cheapest of the range. So it's cheap because it's like, there's about a million miles of it around the country. 
So they screw to the little ball on the outside, the gutter goes in it, we've got a joining piece here, and then we've got a, a downspouty thing. What's that one do? End cap. End cap. So well, obviously with gutters you need to figure out which way it's going to fall. Initially I was going to make it fall that way and then there's a drain over there. I was going to put into the drain but as I said Gemma wants to save the polar bears or something. So what we're going to do is put into, we're going to make it fall that way and then there's going to be a water butt down there. Right, so I've now put a strip off. I'll put the first gutter thing on. Put one at the other end. So I've set this one high. I'll set that one as low as we can. Um, I've got a nice string, so now what I need to do is go along, put all the, these other little smiley face things evenly spaced, and then hopefully the rain should go in the direction we want it to. And without locking the line, let's go and see another beam. Just on it. Just bouncing on there, isn't it? So can I have some help? You think like doing this we would have bought like some step ladders we and not we pour you talk a cool box on my garden furniture? <laughs> Do you think it's gonna hold your way? I don't know, like, I think this isn't racist for two humans, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Right, what are we doing? Putting this gutter on now. Only anyway, one you told the camera up. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's dangerous way of being a camera woman, yeah. Right, so what you do now, you put that in there like that. I can't see what I'm filming. Okay, you're doing you're doing a good job. You're doing a good job. So we'll overhang it ever so slightly. And then I think all you do is rotate. There you go. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. oh yes, you feel accomplished? Yeah, that was good. Doing like 20 years time when these aren't leaking, you're going to go, I did that. Does that mean I'm on a roof for now? <laughs> and we'll be by the end of the day. Yeah. Right, do you want your next level? Can we not use it as click bait? Mm. I, was, I was thinking then that I was like 20 years younger. and um, Yeah, and then I was thinking that I'm, I must weigh about 8 tons of all this water. Yeah, we still got it. We still got it. Don't want to tie myself out though. So while we're waiting for the rain to go away, before we can put the roof on, what we're doing now is we're just adding in some longitudinal bits on the roof. Nearly there. Technically maybe a noggin. A noggin. Don't worry, just come to my head then. Come <laughs> to my noggin. I think it's because you bumped your noggin on it. Getting tired now. I'm getting tired. Don't get tired now. We've got like 10 sheets of 18 mil <laughs> to throw up on the roof. Okay, I think I've got my stuff. <laughs> right, can you remember what the measurement was? Eight foot. No, it wasn't. We wrote it down behind you. Oh. Two, three, eighty. Um, I'm about to make a stick or something. No, I can't. Know. Out. It's 
sun seems to be coming out. So when you're on the line? Yeah. Hang myself over the edge a bit. Cool. She's a beauty. So we are officially dried it. No, we're not <laughs> ready to put the roof on. All day the weather's like not going to rain today. Not going to rain today. It's just stopped and I can just see the very first bit of blue sky. So what we're going to do, go and have some dinner, come back and get the roof on. It is now one o'clock and we are due rain at six. So can we get a whole roof done in five hours? Meaning getting all the boards on and getting the waterproof coating on before the rain comes. That's today's challenge. Ah! First job, let's move the umbrella and make it quick. Done. Lights next. Oh, yeah. But first, let's get the rubber on the roof. <laughs> yeah. Should we do the lights first? <laughs> lights. Hmm. Definitely going to need some good lighting in here, aren't we? Because mm. there's no windows. No, there's mm. not, is there? Maybe we need some portholes. <gasps> oh, give it on boat themed. Well, maybe we should cork the planks. <laughs> <laughs> okay, rubber's on the roof. Yeah, that was heavy, that was. Get up there. Right, let's get it laid out. I'll just put my foot through your table. <laughs> Okay, so now we've got the rubber on the roof. What we need to do is glue it down. So obviously it's completely spread out at the moment over the whole roof. So what we're gonna do is roll one side of it back, put some special glue under it, let that dry, then roll it back, try not to get any wrinkles in it, even though the roof's already, it's already wrinkled because it's been folded, so. But we have one roller. <laughs> it's a big roll though, so it's fine. Um, yeah, anyway, so, so while Gemma's like sniffing stuff, <laughs> Smelly. She's not even got the glow out yet, and she's Stink. like sniffing stuff already. It smells like a sheep. Smell it. Actually, does. It smells like a sheep. Don't. Like, uh. I've never sniffed a sheep. To be honest with you. Anyway, right. Let's roll it. I was trying to say before, before Gemma really interrupts it. Fold it back, glue it, and then fold it back, and then we'll fold the other side, and then do that. But what we've got to do is leave a hundred mil of a lip all around the other side. Okay. And then we use a different kind of adhesive then on the hundred mil per perimeter. Right, let's do it. Is it flying your head tired then? Now. I was gonna whack it off. What color are you painting it? 
<laughs> Ooh, it's weird, isn't it? Some fish, do you think it needs to be? Just like that. Perfect. Perfect. I'm quite glad it's cold today because this could, if it's dead hot, the glue could um, tack off too quick. So the uh, sort of flash time on it is between like 5 and 15 minutes, obviously depending on the weather. So we're about 13 degrees today. And it's quite warm actually today, isn't it, considering? Well, yeah, at least it's not like sun on it though, so it'll, it won't go off as fast, will it? Because obviously I've got a big area to do with one little roller. I'm just wondering if you're going to like paint yourself off the edge of the boat. Oh. Don't, don't forget to leave 100 mil. You remember that, didn't you? Yeah, of course. So at one o'clock we didn't even have a sheet of OSB on the roof, did we? So we've got all the wood on the roof and it is now watertight and it is 10 to 4. So under three hours <laughs> to get all that done. That's quite an achievement really, isn't it? So we are still two hours shy of the rain coming, well ahead of schedule. You know when you said we were going to play with rubber on Valentine's Day? <laughs> this isn't the rubber that I thought you meant. <laughs> <laughs> Today's dry! Woo! No rain! <laughs> it's been a few days later. Yeah, we've been the boat, Joe. Yeah. So <laughs> we've come back. So, what we can do now is get the last wall done. So when you haven't got a ladder, work from a trampoline. Some of these are building sites, because then instead of using a ladder, you can just like jump. <laughs> So the wood's going to come up to there and so it's going to come up to Shire. Got a doorway. So what we were panicking about was going to be so dark, but is it dark? It's not actually that bad, really. We've got like a lot of light in the car. Oh, that, that's beautiful, that light, <laughs> isn't it? Right, so now we need to put the the planks on the outside now.
Right, so we've done all the front now, and what we've been left with is loads of offcuts. So we went to the workshop, we cut all these, and where these are going to go is uh, along the front. <laughs> Look alright, won't it? So we'll start on the corner, work our way out. That just throws that clamp. Also got a step ladder as well when we went to work, because we've been working off boxes and broken tables, so. Just a clamp. So we have one big problem now. Which is? We ran out of wood. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so obviously we've still got to finish all underneath. Still got a few little snagging things to do. So next time yeah. when we have more wood, we'll get it all finished on the outside mm. and maybe make a door. <laughs> it's a door now, but it all needs to dry out as well. It's a bit, it's still a bit wet, in there, yeah. but it's dried out. 10 times yeah. since the last walk. So. so come back next time and hopefully we'll get it all finished and then we can start putting all the little finishing touches yes. on it. One hour lights, sockets. Yeah, so I got something special planned. Ooh. So see you all next time. Thank you all so much for watching. Bye for now. See you later, guys. To follow along on this build and everything else we do, please hit that subscribe button. See you all soon.